don't give him the mojo. <laughs> want to work. <laughs> <laughs> How's that for a first date? <laughs> the new Titleist TSR3 driver almost immediately became the most popular driver on tour, but why is that? Today, we're going to test it against the past three Titleist drivers in its category and see what Trackman tells us about the differences. Golfers, if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel, you like the video, and you tell us in the comments what you think of the new TSR drivers from Titleist. Hey golfers, I'm Drew Mahova with Second Swing Golf, joined by Danny Farrell, Master Club Fitter at Second Swing. We're outside on the driving range with, well, one new driver and three <laughs> really popular older drivers. Right. Um, in my hand is the 917 D3, and then you have TS3, TSI3, and the brand new TSR3. Ooh. If you haven't yet, make sure you go check out the Swing Report video mm -hmm. on the new TSR drivers. So, yeah. today we're testing TSR3 against yep. past models in his category. I'm very excited for this team. Me too, me too. Yeah, we just did a TSR2 uh, yep. video where I was actually swinging them a little bit. I saw some gains. Yeah. So I know with your speed, seeing the transition from the last couple of generations, this TSR, I'm really happy about yeah, this one. Yeah. Really, really happy. So a couple things changed. Um, obviously, from a tech perspective, it looks a lot different, mm -hmm. yep. right? The shape looks a lot different. The weight track as well, that's still kind of the same from last year, a little yeah. bit improved there. But biggest improvement from TSI to TSR is the new speed ring, yeah. BFT Tech. Yep. So that makes the sweet spot a little bit larger. A lot of players are gonna fit into the, T the TSR3, yep. just for the high launch, low spin tendencies that we've already seen this deliver right. with. Right, so. I think you're, that's the reason it's become so popular already among best players in the Tour. world. Yeah. You really got a ton of energy centered in that, in that middle of the club face with that yep. speed ring technology yeah. and a bunch of energy at, at that contact right yeah. there. So I'm excited to test it out. Yep. Um, we'll start with the 917 D3, Kay. work our way up to the newest stuff, Kay. and then we'll see what Trackman shows in the numbers. Yeah, we've got, we've got a pretty into, into our face wind right now. Yeah. So it should be easy on you, Drew. <laughs> yeah. but let's get after it. A little cut, but okay. Yo, that was good. Sounds so different. Yes, tinny. Yeah. Oh, give him the mojo. Turn it over a little bit. Stay in the range. Oh, she gone. Did it go over? Yep. Uh, that's a different flight. It's a little bit low on the face, which might be part of that, but is it still a little higher spin because of that? Uh, marginally, but efficiency even low on the head was the highest we've seen today really? so far. So even low on the head is managing ball speed very, very well. Okay. I came a little bit more up on that one. That one's gonna be fun. That <laughs> one'll work. <laughs> How's that for a first date? <laughs> yeah, boy. Yeah, that should be good. Good ball. All right, so Danny, you've got the information there. Mm -hmm. um, I first want to just kind of talk about what I thought in terms of the look and feel. Let's do it. So I think it was the TS3 when I transitioned from the D3 mm -hmm. uh, 917 to the TS3. Yeah. Crazy difference in sound. It was, <laughs> yeah. I think you called it a tin can. Is yeah. that actually kind of what it felt? I mean, it sounded like it yeah. was just a crazy difference. But then you could definitely see the, the, the profile, the footprint of the club gets smaller and smaller. Mm -hmm. I thought the D3 917 yeah. was almost like TSR2 shape. Mm, um, it was kind of like that. So kay. there's um, there's clearly a, a trend of getting smaller and kind of kay. less to look at, if you will, at address. So um, I which, noticed that. Which head gave you the most confidence out of the four? You know, the TSR3 is pretty good. It's yeah. pretty good. It's <laughs> yeah. clean. It's clean and. Um, I think because I'm, you know, I, I kind of need lower spin. I mean, yeah. I, I, I have a lot of speed on my swing. So mm -hmm. I, I know if I get a big club head, I know I get that fear of if I'm going to spin it a ton. It's <laughs> right. going to go like that. So yeah. um, I think that's why the TSR3 for me is the most confident. Awesome. Out of all of them, so. Awesome. Okay. So let's break down some numbers. So first off, club speed is about the same across the board. Uh, TS3, 
was interesting. He swung that one the fastest, which was mm -hmm. interesting. Then he went back down in club speed with TSI, and then came back up with TSR. Mm -hmm. So the speed project, okay. gaining a little bit more speed, okay. that definitely showed. Interesting. Okay. 917 D3, ball speed wise, this is pre prior to um, the new design phase technology that yep. that title has launched from TS3 to TSI. Yep. So prior to that, ball speed wasn't as consistent across the sure. head. Miss hits were a lot more unstable, sure. let's call it flight yep. wise. So with TrackMan, that's kind of verifying that as well. Ball speed was 165.7. Okay. Spun at three grand, yeah. okay, with a 10 launch. So 276, 296 total. Okay. And that's that's our that's starting a lot of, That's point. a lot of spin for me, you know? I mean, Too much. It, it is. Too yeah. much, yeah. We're more looking for the high launch, low spin duo. Right, right, right. So once we stepped into the TS3, things changed a little bit. Our club speed got a little bit hotter. Ball speed car carried right along with yep, that yep. as well. Launch was the same, but now spin actually changed dramatically, okay? Went from three grand to about 2,300. Okay. So we picked up 10 in carry and about 20 there out we go. the back door. All right. 20. Not bad. Okay. So big jump. That's okay. just one generation there. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So now we're going to jump into the TSI 3. Club speed down just a fraction, but ball speed the fastest. What does that say? All right. That's, more efficient yeah. is what that mm -hmm. says. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So a little bit more stable across the face, 149. So I'm gonna bring that up. 1.45 smash with the 917, mm -hmm. 144 with TS series, TSI series, big bump. Yeah. 149 on average. Yep. So very, very good. Lowest launch of the day with the TSI 3, launched at nine and spun the highest, or one of the highest at okay. 28. Okay. Okay. So still okay numbers. Uh, still picked up a little bit of carry on the TS3 uh, series. A little bit more out the back, or about the same out the back door as well. So, okay, okay. So, so now we get to the big dog, the new dog, here. the one we've been waiting the TSR3. for. TSR3. So let's, yes. let's let's. I'm curious on this now because yeah. I, I felt like a couple of ones I hit were the, f the furthest I think, yeah. but I guess we'll see. Yes, and I mean the title is the Speed Project, right? Faster, straighter, longer. Yeah. So lo looking at the data, we definitely got the longer part of it. Yep. Ball speed's the hottest. Um, efficiency was fantastic. Launch actually was two degrees higher. Which we want to see, yeah. Okay, from the TSI three to TSR three, yeah. So launch two degrees higher, spun three hundred RPMs less, mm -hmm. and what I'm really thrilled about is the spin consistency. Too, yeah, how stable that is on the miss hits. So with the TSR, the lowest spin, um, consistency wise, two sixteen. Okay, so that's all it changed. Yeah. So okay. good, good stuff from Titles across the board. Two twenty seven with the nine seventeen, two sixty six with TS. 229 and 216 okay. ultimately with the latest and yeah. greatest so yeah. faster straighter longer yeah that's a good recipe yeah it is absolutely i think there was one of the shots i think it maybe turned a little left on me yeah. um, but the other two were i think pretty straight but, absolutely um there was I, I definitely again most confidence i think even when i hit it too it had the best feeling mm -hmm. on that impact so and sound as well was more muted yeah. right mm -hmm. a little bit yeah because you kind of went it was a little bit muted with the 917, and yep. we got that tin can noise with <laughs> yeah. the TS3, yeah. and then it kind of just got a little bit quieter after that. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, But I think really good progression overall from Titleist with these yeah. drivers, and I think over the last few years, they've definitely uh, made them more players-oriented yes. in this category, that kind of three um, driver, if you will, Absolutely. making them a little bit smaller, compact head. I guess not smaller, but smaller footprint that you're mm -hmm. looking at. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, you know, moving that center of gravity around to generate low spin while still maintaining a higher yes. launch. So yeah. I, I'm thrilled with it. This is this is a driver that's right up my alley, I think. So check this out. You ready for this? I am. So from the 917 to the TSR, 20 yards in the air, 20. And half a yard, four, about 25 yards out the back door. Okay. And straighter. So that's a that's a four four generation difference. I mean, we're yep. talking about what eight years probably in yep. drivers, six seven years in drivers. Yep, yep. Um, I, I will take that. Absolutely. So that means that means Titleist is doing its job, getting better every generation <laughs> yeah. and yep. giving golfers better performance. So yep. uh, I think you know pretty good results today. Absolutely. Uh, I am actually pleasantly surprised with how that went. Uh, with you know just seeing the results and seeing that you know we hear from Titleist and we 
your faster, longer, straighter. Yeah. Uh, we'd like to validate it, and I think Absolutely. we did today. So. Definitely did. Definitely did. This makes me even more excited for the TSR launch mm -hmm. that's going to be coming soon. Sure. So. Sure. Well, golfers, uh, you know what to do if you're interested in a TSR driver or, I guess, one of the uh, previous models, TSI3, TS3, or 917D3. You can schedule a fitting for new or used at Second Swing in store or with our, one of our uh, online fitters, and we'll get you dialed in, hitting better tee shots, higher, Straighter, Straighter. Longer. longer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. yeah exactly. So, uh, and of course, if you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and leave a comment, tell us what you think about the new TSR drivers. Danny, thanks for joining today. Always. We'll see you next time.